Hi guys. So I am at the Poundland Christmas event, not surprisingly, and I thought I would share it with you all, anyone who couldn't make it. I'm going to start at the top of the stairs because, as I flip the screen, Cassia, super stylist assistant, did all of this staircase and it took all day and I can't tell you how beautiful it looks but it smells divine. So as you walk into the launch, you just walk down this amazing staircase. So Cassia, well done, it is stunning. I also had two other assistants. I had Charlotte and Chantel. I'll put their links below because they were absolutely great. Three amazing assistants. So Christmas trees and I'm going to take you into the first room. So there's, there's four um, themes. This one here is Yuletide Jewel, which is all your purples and your um, teals. I'm getting very distracted by Rachel. So lots of lovely colours going in. And I have to show you these giant baubles. Whoppers. It's very dark down here in the vaults, but look, as you can see. Gorgeous. One pound each. Amazing. Then I'm going to take you through to the next one, which is Northern Lights, which is quite hard to see in here with my dodgy phone. But like they're, oh no, it's showing up quite nicely actually. They're like really pretty teal, powdered teal colour, really sweet, and lots of geometrics going on in there. And then they're doing some more, um, other priced products. This one's five pound, a little light up house. And then these little glowy bell jars, they're a pound. Nice wrapping papers geometrics going on there too and then I'm going to take you through to the next one which is Nordic so this is kind of like wooden and feels very woody there's lots of lovely um, cushions God, there's loads of people so I'm a bit distracted um, hessian sacks and this one's got lots of blue in it with the little Merry Christmas signs really nice wrapping paper in this room it's really lovely and this Noel it's five pounds. We're going to swipe an E later on. And then we've got lots of like woody decorations, like pretend candles. And then I'm going to look around to this is, um, multi price items. So wreaths that are, I can't say that, wreaths, wreaths that are between two and five pounds. And then these boxes, these boxes are so strong, they'll like last forever. Great for props, I think. Then another Noel sign, the star that comes in red and white. And there's nutcrackers, light up tree toppers, lots of advent calendars, really, really sweet. A giant box of crackers. Absolute whopper, great presents in there, like um, keychains and stuff like that. Then there's some paperware, some paper plates, all of those sorts of kind of party wear things. And then all of this copper cocktail range, these are two pound each. I can't tell you how many times I've hired one of these ice buckets. That's two pounds. So I'm going to buy about three of them and spray paint in different colours when I need different colours. Right, so lots of gifting. And then this is the 12 days of Christmas, which is much more traditional. Lots of gold, red, it's really pretty. I love these big fronds. Don't know what you, else you'd call them, but very nice. And then little nutcracker. Really cute little bloke. So he's two for a pound and then these I love these so a little it's a London thing iconic decorations they're really heavy good quality and again more boxes these boxes are so great oh, this is Mr Nutcracker's five pounds he's like I'm gonna he um, talks and then really great boxes like really solid you keep them afterwards that's for sure then there is homewares Lots of um, plaques, signs, stars and hearts, light up bottles, then these really cute little um, reindeers. These come in white, silver and this kind of bronzy colour. Oops. And then they've also got amazing lights, loads and loads of lights. Not showing you these very well, but they've got... Um, bells and little kind of furry baubles and snowflakes and Christmas trees and there's a whole load of kids stuff. Now I'm going to take you through to the other room which has 
stockings and Christmas sacks and this seems to have gone down quite a lot these are amazing I was eating these all of last night they had to keep refilling the jars because every time I walked through to empty like the rooms of all the empty boxes I kept eating them then this they're doing filming so I'm going to talk a bit quieter these are the confectionery which I'm sure you can imagine there are lots of and you can see they're filming over there so I'm going to be very quiet over here but um, I have to be quiet I'll try and come back we're going to show you Halloween so I'm not sure if I'm going to lose contact here because I'm literally in the vaults underneath the strand I should imagine so there's loads and loads of um, scary looking Halloween but this bloke's right underneath the um, air conditioning unit so it keeps blowing and looking a bit creepy they do great Halloween stuff really great some of it's really gross like that as you would want but it's all quite clever and it's, it's right really good price I mean look at this boo five pound for that boo look at that rat oh my god he is just horrible horrible but yeah there's another little light up house spooky one for Halloween and these drinks dispensers they're really good fun there's the house again it's quite hard to see down here it's so dark yeah and they kind of do day of the dead things as well flashing lights that I think my daughter would absolutely love and then they've got loads of tableware Hall um, what are they called um, honeycomb pumpkins and then day of the dead tableware these oh my god they're so good peanuts very nice yeah so loads of little accessories and things right I will try and go back and show you the elf because I'm a little bit obsessed with the elf but if I can't I'll just take a picture and share it later on my Instagram follow me on Instagram and the MT stylist no, they're still filming okay I'm gonna head off but um, thanks for stopping by guys and if you need to feature anyone um, I will put the link below, which I don't know off the top of my head. Anyway, see you soon. Bye.